The OBR forecasts the UK's inflation rate to be 9.1 per cent this year and 7.4 per cent next year. They confirm that our actions today help inflation to fall sharply from the middle of next year. They also judge that the UK, like other countries, is now in recession. I start with personal taxes. Asking more from those who have more means that the first difficult decision I take on tax is to reduce the threshold at which the 45p rate becomes payable from £150,000 to £125,140. Those earning £150,000 or more will pay just over £1,200 more in tax every year. Next, windfall taxes. I have no objection to windfall taxes if, if they are genuinely about windfall profits caused by unexpected increases in energy prices. But, but I have decided that from January 1 until March 28, we will increase the energy profits levy from 25 to 35 per cent. The structure of our energy market also creates windfall profits for low carbon electricity generation. So from January 1 we have decided to introduce a new temporary 45 per cent levy on electricity generators. Together these measures raise £14 billion next year. For the remaining two years of the spending review, we will protect the increases in departmental budgets we have already set out in cash terms and then grow resource spending at 1 per cent a year in real terms in the three years that follow. But I will soften the blow on businesses with a nearly £14 billion tax cut over the next five years. Nearly two-thirds of properties will not pay a penny more next year and thousands of pubs, restaurants and small high street shops will benefit.